society. I hate propriety. Art is calling for me. Hi and welcome to the simple Vocaloid walkthrough video. As you could hear, we're programming the last eight bars of Art is Calling for Me, which is a song Victor Herbert composed in 1911. So that's a song with I Hate Society in the lyrics way before the Sex Pistols. We're using Vocaloid Cyber Diva. And the software we are using is Vocaloid Editor 4, which is a standalone application, it's not a plugin. There's also Vocaloid Editor for Cubase and a plugin called Piapro Studio, which is made by another company called Krypton, but we're using Yamaha's standalone Vocaloid Editor here. The dialog box you saw at the very beginning is where we set the tempo, and now we are entering the notes into the piano roll with rests and everything, just like it is in the score. It's a very simple score, pretty much one note per syllable with one exception um, and a few rests. So we are just uh, punching in the notes at this point, no lyrics. And once we get the last note in, we'll be able to hear what that sounds like. So this is Cyber Diva's vowel legato singing style. It sounds pretty good without any tweaking, except for the last note, which is very long, so the glide also ends up being too long. Um, but that could be tweaked if you actually need a legato. In this case, we don't. Um, we need to change the singing style to the normal singing style, which has no legato, and then set legato only for the one note that needs it. And with that done, we can then enter the lyrics. We just enter them all at the first note in plain English, so it's very, very simple. The only thing that's different than just typing in the words is that there is a dash after calling, and what that does is it extends the ling syllable across two notes, since that's the one syllable in the song that gets more than one note. And now she sings the lyrics. I hate society. I hate propriety. Art is calling for me. Now it sounds reasonably clear and understandable, uh, pretty cute and robotic. And cute works for this song, but robotic is not so good, so we need to add some expression. We can do that with the dynamics control parameter, which works pretty much like any sustained instrument that would have dynamics linked to MIDI CC. We can draw a curve with the pencil tool or use the line tool for straight lines, and we're just basically making this up as we go along, uh, thinking which words would be emphasized, where there might be a peak in the dynamics, and generally keeping it pretty high since the last line is marked fortissimo in the score, and lines before that are marked forte. Now there are a lot of other parameters that can be tweaked. Um, this is probably the most important one for sounding like an expressive human singer. If we wanted her to sound less cute, we might use, for example, the growl parameter, and uh, maybe the gender parameter. Um, but for this one, for our purposes, um, dynamics is really the most important one we need. We could also try different phonemes to get uh, the words to flow more naturally like a person singing, but in this case, the default dictionary really does a pretty good job, except for the word calling, which ends up sounding a little funny. And now there are videos out there that deal with this kind of uh, thing in detail. Um, since we're trying to make this quick, let's just stick to dynamics. And once we get the curve finished, we'll be able to hear uh, the difference that that makes. And just one more note. I hate society. I hate propriety. Art is calling for me. Now it's much better, but let's just make the vibrato on that last note a little more organic. Um, now, uh, vibrato doesn't work like dynamics, it's not a global control parameter, it's set individually per note. Let's try the extreme vibrato, see just how extreme that is, and we'll have the depth and speed vary since this is the last note of the song, you kind of want it to reach this big uh, dramatic peak, so if a singer was singing that, um, you know, a real human singer would probably um, you know, not single with uh, constant, uh, constant vibrato, but kind of peak and then fall off towards the end. I hate society. I hate propriety. Art is calling for me. 
Okay, that was terrible and silly. Let's try not so extreme vibrato with a similar kind of shift in depth and speed. So we'll just recreate the curve that we had before, more or less. And uh, then we will have uh, sort of a similar, similar expression, but not quite uh, so uh, ridiculous and exaggerated. And once we have that, then we'll have our final result. Society, I hate propriety. Art is calling for me.